With cheers and support from the packed stands at the RBC Centre, the 16 and under men's Nova Scotia team entered the arena with a traditional dance. I'm so excited to welcome everyone here today. Following their entrance, there were words from Wagmacook Chief Norman Bernard. A ceremonial face-off was the final step in the small ceremony before the game. The game between Wisconsin and Nova Scotia was tightly contested throughout with plenty of hard-hitting action. Goals from Nova Scotia had them out to an early 4-0 lead. But Team Wisconsin was not going down without a fight. The game remained close until the final buzzer, which saw the hosts walk away with a 7-5 victory. For Nova Scotia's Brody Boyd, to play in front of the home fans and family was an experience like no other. That was, that was crazy. But we never play in this rink, and the other ones don't got stands, so this was nice to play in. Uh, yeah, just play for, our, play for our family. Despite the loss, Team Wisconsin players said the atmosphere gave them energy throughout. The cheering is almost like just like another like boost to yourself. Like, you know, you make a big play or the team makes a big play, yeah, you know how to do something, you know. It's just like the crowd is nothing I've ever experienced before. Usually when we play like field lacrosse, there's not usually that many people, but I came out here, I was like, holy. It's like all these all these people just came here to see us play. So I'm, I, I was amazed how many people popped I came out. So it was nice. Boyd has a passion for lacrosse that includes playing for others. I play for family, I play for my teammates, I play for everyone else, and it's just fun. It's, yeah, I just play for the ones who can't. Even with all of the slashing, hitting, and trash talk, everyone came together at the end of the game to meet up and give their respects, something the Wisconsin players enjoyed. I got hit over there, I felt my back crack when I hit the wall, and then there was a lot of trash talk between us, and then um, I thought that we wasn't going to get along after the game, but after the game, we all shook up, and then, like, we was all just, you know, like, glad to make it out. You know, it was actually fun. I love how, you know, we all come together, and after the game, we just, you know, after all the intense, you know, like, just shoving and stuff and, you know, pushing, it's just we all, like, indigenous people at the end of the day, so we can just all come together and really appreciate the sport. Daryl Stranger, APTN National News, Dartmouth.